take it back. And uh, Eric, confusion, always problems. That's Cruz against this in the schools. He looks through the gap. He finds the gap. Oh, my goodness. Other end at this ball. A much needed down. He's lost out of the gap. Well, it was. And it. And that ball, getting, it's got a bit of spin on it. And it's just down in the spin. So well the shot. So it clunks down the ground. It's gone for four. Astor can't get across. So Cruz not finding the middle of the bat. So there's a runner ball on anyway. With the field, even inside the ring, standing right back on the edge. Two to go. And the trees are winding into this, but once again, they're going to make a pick in the end. We have to make a fair amount of ground to get to the stumps, but once again, we've got to have a He's called for the third umpire. I have my doubts here. This is out. Let's have a look. Come off from that picture. Oh, so safe. Yeah, I think he's. Uh, I think he's pretty safely in there. Possibility. Well, let. Yeah, the big pity we can't see from the other side. They both look at the same place. Because I thought there, when they saw the second time, there was a possibility. There's no way he could get it. Two balls gone. Full toss in just a single. And one's pleasing for hit on strike. Get down to the ball up. Full toss can just be the single. And he's in that mind uh, single. what he wants, and that the South Africans are going to hit with the six. But it's going to be difficult to hit boundaries when uh, Nash Bowles deliveries like that. That's in the black hole. It's not dead straight. This one is swapped it straight up in the air. It could be caught easily by Roger Cruz. Strike, and that's not what South Africa wants. Five 
to win. Two balls remaining. Well, Steve Elworthy has played so well the last two games in uh, the fifth match. The last fifth match in Wellington with South Africa won now. In the one day of Baldwell yesterday, Baldwell today, and he comes in and faces his first delivery with two balls remaining in the match. Leading four to tie and five to win. Well bowled, we'll just be the single, and Cleesner has to take well where he wants his second to get back on strike. If he'd been as keen to run the previous ball, it would have made more sense. You know, last Cleesner needs to hit the final ball to the boundary to win the game for South Africa. If he doesn't, it's just field's not big enough for him to get more than two. And you'll see that the field is sprinting from either side to back up any possible overthrow. In fact, if a New Zealand player whistles the ball in towards the stumps, it's quite unnecessary for him to do so. There's a discussion going on with the umpire. I think Lance Cruz is saying uh, maybe an overlight there. <laughs> so here we go, the final ball of this one day international for the win. He wrestles up, it's a big knock, he's hit a distance, the 